Hey, welcome back everybody. Welcome to my Dumbo movie review. So I saw Dumbo opening Thursday, and there were not a lot of people in the theater. I feel like Disney did not have a lot of faith in this movie. Maybe they saw a clip, and um, it just there was there was very little to no hype about this. And I, I would think that they'd want to hype it. They are hyping these movies. I mean, I feel like this one is kind of on the, on par with Pete's Dragon, which they did a little a couple years ago. And Pete's Dragon, I actually was never even a fan of the original. Unlike Dumbo, I am a fan of the original, but not... It was never one of my top ones. Other than a few scenes like the the Pink Elephants on Parade, um, there wasn't really much in that uh, movie that I liked. It's just the movie so... He loses his mom, and then he gets bullied forever. And then he becomes a star. <laughs> and he, I mean, I, I guess it has. it's kind of a happy ending. But if I had to describe this movie in one word, it's just dull. I remember thinking, like, oh my god, how much is left? He veers from the original story. I, I, I almost feel like he should have just done the original story beat for beat, like they did in Beauty and the Beast. Um, but I know some people, this makes them worried for Lion King and for Aladdin, but I'm not because I can tell that they are put, Disney is actively pushing for Aladdin and for Lion King. I'm not going to say this movie is a... St- Dinker, it's it's a below average film, unfortunately, which is sad to say because I love Tim Burton and I love getting Danny DeVito and Michael Keaton back together. And I believe, if I am not mistaken, that this is their first time working together since Batman Returns, the Penguin and Batman. I think back in what was it, 92, 91? Anyway, um, it was just dull. The, the the whole first part of the movie, um, well, the original movie, it's kind of. They blast through that in just a couple minutes, and then it goes into this other kind of sequel thing that he wanted to do, and uh, it didn't work for me. There's <laughs> there's a couple scenes where Michael Keaton is just way too over the top, <laughs> where they're talking about how they need to turn on this power, and he's like, no, no, bar now, and I'm like, wait, wait he's, what? Uh, almost like a cartoon villain, and I, I did think that Tim Burton was a a good choice for this, but his vision wasn't... I don't agree with his vision. I liked the visual style of the movie. Um, And Danny DeVito was the best part of this movie. I loved him in this movie. He even looks like the original... uh, like the original Ringmaster. Um, There's no talking animals, which is sad. And I feel like they brought in uh, Colin Farrell to try and replace, um, I think, Tommy or whatever the, whatever the mouse's name mouse name is. You see a little mouse in a uniform for a brief second, but that's just kind of like a nod to the original film. There's no talking mouse. That's pretty much Colin Farrell and his two kids, which were just thrown in there. He made those characters up. He does do an homage to the pink elephant scene. I won't give away how. I think although I I think it might be in the trailer. I would not recommend this movie. On the Star Fighter scale, I'd give it a 35. It's only March. This is probably the worst movie I've seen this year. It was really... I'm not going to say it's like a horrible, terrible piece of garbage. It's, it's a 35, which it's a D on my scale. Um, but and I, I don't know what else to say other than it's dull. I, I it, And even when he gets separated from his mother... It was so fast, I felt like I should have been heartbroken, and I was just like, okay, that's happening. I don't care. Um, I, I, I don't know. I think they try to give him like these big, cute eyes, and uh, like maybe with his cuteness try and get you to feel something. But I just, uh, I don't know. I, I, I was not emotionally tuned in. And Eva Green's character flips from like kind of like you think she's evil, and then all of a sudden, oh okay, like 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 that. I I didn't I didn't buy it. Suddenly we're supposed to like her in like an instant. So I I I don't know. Um, anyways, um, it's a little bit disappointing. I'm a Disney fan. I'm going to D23 this year, so hopefully Lion King and Aladdin are better. Um, yeah, this, this movie's just going to be forgotten. Again, I don't think I'm ever going to see this movie again. Um, it's just dull. Anyways, let me know what you guys thought. Leave your thoughts below. 
like and subscribe and i will see you guys later okay bye